Hello, and welcome back to Particle Fleet Emergence. On the last episode, we did Emergent and Ties, and on this episode, we'll be going through Secrets, and probably nothing else, but it will depend on how long this will take. Either way, let us begin. Anna reveals a long-held secret. Oh boy. Jump complete. We barely missed an incoming rift incursion. Something large was entering the la that last region of space. Fortunately, three of our amp gems were dislodged in the jump and are now scattered in this system. Okay, that's fine. Should make it a priority to recover them. They should prove invaluable for the upgrades we now have access to. Rapid assessment of this region. Oh. Got some cannons. Got a ship there. Got some more Omnitech. Another cannon there. Giant uh, bacteria. <laughs> more wreckage. Just ship design, wrecks and structures, info cache, all things of interest. The particular seems more dispersed in this system with a central area that has an anomalous structure. Looks like one of the Braxian cannons has been altered by the particulates, and most likely will put up a fight against us. If I can get a lathe close enough, I should be able to purge the particulates and flip it back to our side. Very good. Crew, prepare to engage. Director Kami, in the information we retrieved from the Braxian cache, there was something about Anna. You believe she needs to explain something? Sir, the information contains a log entry from the Gallic Corp chief scientist at the time of the last Braxian chairman. Mentions a message of great importance being sent to Anna from her grandmother, the chief scientist. Ah, I see. In that case, please continue, Anna. Looks down, then looks up to address the crew. I knew this, I knew this day would come, as it must. Chairman Tycon, your name isn't Dagger Tycon, it's Dagger Abraxas. You're the grandson of Chairman Skarsgard Abraxas, the last Abraxian chief of Galcorp. Chief Tycon is an Abraxas? Rumors that Skarsgard Abraxas. Skarsgard's grandson were saved or true? How could you know this? How could it possibly be Ch Chief Tycon? Well, the info cache opened for him, right? Lodge comes to me from my grandmother, who was chief scientist at Galcorp during the Braxian reign, as Kami mentioned. She, is these, she secretly encoded a message before she disappeared that I discovered once I came of age. It said that the Braxian boy had been saved and was in the hands of House Tycon. No one knew. The secret must be kept at all costs. The very fate of humanity depended on it. Why? I mean, obviously, if anyone had known, Chairman Tycon of uh, Abraxas would have been imprisoned or worse. But why keep it from him till now? Because she knew I would never have entered redacted space if I had known. If what you say is true, Anna, then I would have devoted all my resources to fighting and destroying the Galactic Corporation. Yeah, that. Dogger, I've known you for a long time. What I did was for the greater good. What greater good could there be? My grandmother's message didn't say. She only said that the answers were in redacted space and that you, I, and the most able crew we could assemble would one day find out. I guess there are things she thought necessary to keep from me as well. Chief, I'm speechless. If you are the Braxton heir, everything is different. You could return and claim the chairmanship of Galcorp. He said it looks up from the crew. Crew, my name is Chairman Dagger Tycon, and I won't be changing my name anytime soon. If there are any further questions beyond that, you aren't as surprised as I thought you were. Prepare to engage. Okay. He's keeping his name, despite uh, what's happening. We do have a bunch of emitters. We have seven emitters here. A stunner. And an enemy particulated cannon. Sorry, uh, particulate burster. And I suppose we can go for this one. So it has deposits nearby. Let's try to stay away from the snakes. Up and running. We'll 
we'll do is we'll increase mine production and move build speed. Also start off with that benign emergent. Because I feel I really enjoy that one. Despite it probably not being as effective as I think, but I like the look of it. Another wolf class ship was awesome. It's Ogun, take a look at this. Marauder class, rare and exceedingly expensive for its size. It's a general purpose, but heavily armed craft. They were often used to escort Galcorp officials whenever they would visit the academy. Oh, Marauder. Well, she's integrated and now yours to command. Let's see how much she costs. All sides of 98. Appears to have four missiles and four cannons and eight particle beam. Nice. That is very effective in what we're going to be doing. Alright, got our first lead up. Let's get that out of gym now. Uh, I suppose we should have put the Omni Reactors on as well. Well, uh, well, I guess there's an energy mine over there anyway. I defend that Omni. I'll just soak up the damage for now. Okay, so that energy mine has gone offline because they destroyed that. Let's get a Yovan out. Sure, let's try and build this Marauder class. Why not? Need a Discharger as well. Because that Stunner is about to be on in 80 seconds, roughly. With this Amp Gem, we'll make Omni Reactors available to us. Let's try and see if we can squeeze in some. We'll move this over here with the Omnis, try and sneak our way there. We can also go over there, because there is an emitter there. I suppose that's where we should have started, but oh well. Did not notice the allied emitter, because it kind of blends into space. some damage, but I presume we have reactors, so it doesn't really matter too much. We can also get the energy mine. Ooh, that was close. Wonderful. This mine is ours now. Immediately starts as a six. So let's get a wolf up. So well, we have four cannons, four missiles, and three particular beams. Make the rest of the armies on this island. That way we can move them from here to maybe there, or here, maybe even there. No cash retrieved. Score! This is another piece of the parody volume we have been looking for. We still don't have enough to con reconstruct the whole message, but we are getting closer. Alright, well. Base maneuvers, Omnis. Oh man, this is silly. Alright, we can take that hit. It's only one. Alright, go, go, go. <laughs> Seek attack. Alright, now this, on the other hand, is going to be harder to sneak to. While we're here, we may as well get the destroyer up. The Cruiser up and the grabber. Okay. So how many reactors?
attacks aren't really needed here because we can get all these energy mods. I see an opening. I'm gonna take it. enough go. How does this work? Ah, I didn't I changed the last command unfortunately. Okay. Alright, so all this we'll make the other discharger here. For text. Uh I suppose we can go for emitter control. This will let us control this emitter and then we'll send it over to this. Actually, we'll send it over to that snake emitter. Oh, we got an auto destroyed. Damn. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. We were not lucky. Either way, let's keep. More than likely made this now. The amount of weaponry we have. It's also a micro tank here. That's one snake emitter down. There's a uh, hypnosis formation there. The bad am Jim. To in position. Is that cannon shooting at you? What? No. So get the tanker in the back of this for now. Oh my, that's a lot of immersion. Okay, wow. <laughs> it's immersion. Just a bunch of everything here, huh? It was like barely in the energy field. I suppose it works. So what do we do? Hmm. Get rid of the outside emitters first, maybe? I'm having a hard time figuring out what to do next. Let's go with energy range increase, why not? I suppose that'll work for us better. We'll make a hammer over here. Oh, but we don't have a lathe here. No. I suppose it's a risk we have to take. We'll manually do this so we can not lose here. Should I probably just take this in there? Alright. <laughs> maybe. Maybe it's being a bit greedy. Yeah, well. <laughs> Bye. We'll see you later. That a bit down. What do we do with the rest of you? Just get everyone in range. Oh, hold on there, jeez. Yeah, I suppose I could use the, the pulser as a tank. A hammer this doesn't really do much else. The stunners went out, one down. All right. What do we do with you? 
Let's actually aim you towards this now. We'll go for the big bad. See how far you can get. Or if you can just go all the way. Okay, so we have this emitter still, and we have this mine that we can take. Let us fill with particulate there. Let's also get the. Where's the tanker actually? Alright. Right, okay. Uh, we can leave the office there. your cannon. Okay, so we have that energy mine pretty much. Man ship is able to slowly get that built. Let's actually refocus this army. We only need one army there, so let's build two armies back here. Try and make this more efficient for us as we take over more of this mine. So we need it to be unmined to get the energy mined out. Let's see, that's enough. Seems like it. Okay, wonderful. That was already enough. I'll send in two more. Stunners, kind of. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Maybe we have some aversion there. I might destroy it. Nope, it just went away instead. So we'll get this energy mine, and then we can get closer to this cannon. I mean, I'm not going to call it a cannon, because... Or, I'm going to call it a cannon, because that is really what it is, but... Particulate burster. The oven is fast, wow. Two engines, really strong, huh? I need an Omni back there, just for a rogue uh, particulates. Uh, send in the hammer. Get the micro tank out here. Throw a battle ray. Okay. Now we're sending in that. I have to say, the music is really good for this game. <laughs> like, it may not, like, I mean, it, it fits, it fits, but also, it's just really well done, so. I uh, almost got my command HQ there. Let's also try and leave this. Let's wait, let's wait, let's wait until it discharges all of its ammo, and then we can go in on it. This particulate is kind of stuck, right? Oh, I just destroyed it. Went in a bit too early there. Come on. I want stunner, but cannon. Oh man. It's just not gonna happen like that. Take turns. No, you're doing the same mistake. Get rid of that cannon. Alright, fine, get the stunner. Whatever. Jeez. 
Just do something, please. Uh, okay, let's see. Just get this over here. There's a hammer. Just get over here and block this guy. more sense. Probably wise design that way. Not bad. So now on our side has the ammo too. Interestingly enough. There's a lot of particulars stuck in there. Or something along those lines. Let's get rid of that emitter. Okay, so I made all the particulate come out. Not bad. I'm losing my blades because of this. Let's actually just move another one right there. <laughs> to soak the damage. Alright, alright. Should be done. Just need to get rid of the rest of the emitters now. Can use a command ship on that one. Still have some immersion, so that's going to be getting rid of our mines for the most part. So that will give something for the mine cannon to shoot. Oh yeah, we have all that immersion built up. Right. <laughs> How could I have forgotten about that? Of course. It's because I wasn't looking at it, that's why. Oh well. At least we can use it now, I suppose. Dug in a hole. Ran through that. Let's see. It's heavy. You go here. Okay, I can't actually chain commands with a fleet, so that's fine. That mine is down because of immersions. I want to take some omnis over here and try and sneak them through. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Those omnis in quick. Ooh, all right, that should be sufficient. Now we send that. Where's the submitter? Oh, it's right there. Okay. So I'll just make another grabber. Send all this stuff at the snake emitter. Oh, Hammer's doing what Hammer does best. Ramming into things. Well, don't use command. 
center. Oh, okay. It's <laughs> a bit risky. Almost not, but okay. That survives what matters. Oh, I see. So these are like the guppies go to the energy mine and get energy. I see. Uh, oh, there's a emitter right there, too, by the way. Apparently. Oopsie daisy. Let's just turn around for a moment. Now let's turn back around. Actually, just go over there. Get the tanker to help them out. So we get the micro tanker to be like over here instead. To help out. Command. Go. Let's get this. Actually, I can because I need Omnis again. It's all mired already, so. Can, they can handle it. They have the energy too. Alright, command ship is doing that, so this should be it. Not bad, not bad. Actually, we might be able to fit one more, maybe, <laughs> if I go fast enough. Because I was also reading dialogue, so I don't know. We'll have to see. Yeah, I'm aware. I'll just forex this. Additional Omni has been added to our database. Very good crew, excellent work as always. I would like to apologize for being so terse earlier. The information about my heritage was distressing. I lived my whole life as a proud Tycon. My parents were two shining examples of parents. Knowing I came to them from others and that they loved and cared for me as their own only increases my admiration and respect for them in return. Director Kami, does the information we retrieve from the Braxton cache contain any other information about what they were doing and why they were conducting a secretive or secret initiative? No, sir, not directly. It mentions a lot of technical talk about entropy and information density. The only, the only references I can't explain are mentions of some group called the Savoy and some device called the Ark. Other than that, nothing. Oh man, the Savoy and the Ark, huh? Alright, let's move on to 12 doppelgangers. That is a creeper shaped ship, alright. Or creeper particulate shaped ship. I, I'm always gonna get that wrong because there's just no reason to call it particulate really either, but it's fine. A dangerous escalation threatens the crew's existence. Jump complete and scanners are already detecting an anomaly. There are three structures here we have not previously encountered. There are, they are definitely infested with particulates, but there is no way to tell exactly what they do from the scans. From the scans, it seems possible these structures manufacture something related to the particulate. I detect an internal weights design of sorts. The design is otherwise unfamiliar. One thing is for sure, if I can get one or more laser range, they won't be a problem, whatever they do. Very well, let's collect the tech in this system and keep a close eye on those structures. These structures, I suppose. Yeah, three of them. Okay. Now we're starting really far back. Very good. Oh, that's a lot. Okay. <laughs> let's, uh... 
some early early game woes right there. Look at that. That's a real clump, isn't it? Press pause here. Let's do plant potential energy range increase. Move build speed. Uh what was this one again? Oh, the mines have dischargers, okay. Let's do emergent, but not emergent, a better control. And... Nice, Omni Reactors. Let's get that Omni. Let's build Omnis everywhere here. Another Omni has been added to our license database. Alright, we have 11 now. We'll control you to go up there. Scanner is detecting activation of the unknown structures. As I fear, the structures are manufacturing a core of sorts. This core has the unbelievable ability to create particulates and to manage and control it. See what it's doing? It's trying to copy our ships, using the particulate to create a primitive hull. Steady O gun. If it's made out of particulate, our weapon should be able to destroy it. But it should, sir. It's just uncanny to see these doppelgangers. What's more interesting is that these structures are able to manufacture particulate and control it. The structures don't appear to be created by the particulates, but could instead be a Braxian in origin. Or the experiments they were perform performing, perhaps. Manipulating and controlling the Particulates. Perhaps my uh, grandfather managed to achieve some technological breakthroughs that he, he thought could rid redacted space of the particulates, or even use the particulate for some purpose. Perhaps. Yeah, it really is making that shit. Okay. What are, what are we? What's happening? Okay. We're losing? Are we losing yet? Get the wolf out. Get the wolf out now. Oh, gun? You guys can't? Just look. You're so organized. So no, it's staying. Like how Corp Big Nose assault the ship. I've seen pictures, never the actual ship. The ship is built around the MK7 Tri Cannon. Will deliver a massive punch at great range. Correct your gun. I thought the MK7 was never licensed and was only used on ships directly owned by the Galactic Corporation. And around, I, I don't see any Galacorp officers around here, so that, my friend, isn't true anymore. Sure, let's build it. Look at that tri cannon. Look, look at that beauty. Let's build it. I suppose we can get this mine. Yeah, now what? Now what, huh? Can't get it. Can't get it. It's not free anymore. Oh man, that really is just a cruiser. Okay. And a lathe. They have a lathe as well. Uh, I guess defensive truck now. Just for their ships. Ah. Uh, well, they don't have tri cannons yet, I suppose. So they're just flying around. What? <laughs> Hey, is that like permanent? Oh wow, so that's just permanent now as well. Oh, you just flew into that, man. Let's take advantage of that. Well, fortunately, it's submitting more. Alright, 
I'm sorry about that. We'll pause for a second there. Oh, we could set an emergent rally point, or we could just not have one set and see what happens. Let's just go with that, actually. So now we need defensive struck because their ships are gonna be annoying. I'm supposed to try cannons, I'm supposed to take out the ships. Okay, we don't have any dischargers, so that's gonna stun. We're gonna get stunned here. Seems like it's the Yovin and the Vi. That's actually a problem, but okay. Build a tanker. And a micro tank in the middle of these. Cool, cool. On fire, but it missed. The economy was destroyed. So build it again. Build it again, then. Tank is fine. Let's get to this emitter. Oh, you missed. Uh, Try cannon miss, but it has slightly it, yeah, I suppose. Oh boy, that's not good. That's what's gonna happen, okay? You get that ship? Oh, almost. Too much particulate in the way, apparently. Pulsars are online, so let's move them into place. Get those snakes out of the way, jeez. Okay, we'll just ram into that one. And the repulsor. Oh, okay. That's fine, you know. Doppel. Alright. Let's get this in range. Okay, that should eliminate that threat. Let's see what else is there. I mean, it should. Oh, but we're out of energy, of course. We're out of energy. Let's try this. Uh, I don't want the repulsor in front. I want the micro tank to be like right here instead. Act as a supply line. Okay. Works. Command ship is just doing a full rotation. No big deal. Articulate emitters. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll just those three in the back with the ships being built. I suppose we should get a hammer to get rid of this space gunk. Particles in space. Uh, sorry, Yovin, though. Should get rid of some of that, too, right? Yeah. Or a Marauder class will pass as well. I 
have to move those yet. Just keep them in line. Move this emitter to actually attack that land. It's going right for us. Wow, this is smart. <laughs> I'm glad we got that defensive strike. Turns out it's actually been useful. For the rest of our armies. Here they are. Let's get you to power that cannon. Oh, right. That's fine, we can just build you closer now. Without worrying about having to dodge anything. Wait to get a little bit more health. Uh, send this. No, send this one to that island. <laughs> Asteroid. Whatever. <laughs> Space islands, you know. You know how it is. Claim that for ourselves. Move this army closer to the center. Command ship is taking damage for whatever reason. Let's get this tri nose. Tri cannon, big nose model. Destroy the ship for us. Wonderful. Okay. And we make a move on their sh ship builders. Maybe that emitter. We get this emitter, then we can get that line. That secures a foothold there. Let's just build some more ships while we're here. Because we haven't yet. Closing in on that. The oven, get over there, please. Let's get this out here. As soon as we get you to uh, send this there, and we'll redirect it to the emitter instead with that grabber that we build. Cruiser protect that, so these two gentlemen join our fleet. Alright, never mind. I guess I'll do manually do that one as well. The wolf class got impede, but that should be fine. Uh, back up through the ships and whatnot. That dock was destroyed. Wonderful. Get the hammer in here. Actually, they're probably just nullifying us now. Send a merchant rally point to the submitter. That's risky. It's a lot of snakes there. Probably don't have enough energy, honestly. Oh, well, we have this now, I suppose. So. Should be good for us. Let's 
Let's try. Also wants to get over here. Try to push, but to no avail. Let's go for this now. Get our other lathe in here as well. Got a micro tank into this. Supply that take her back. Okay, hammer her way through. Let's try to take it. Let's destroy the cannon. This poor, uh, this poor, uh, particular doesn't really have a function yet. It's sort of being blocked. So our tank is not in range now. That should repair that. Set the immersion rally point to this. Other lathe to help out with the defensive struck. Uh, I guess we can get some of the armies back here. Yeah, so there's like bigger chunks of emergence and smaller chunks of emergence, so that's probably indicative of their health remaining. Start protecting everyone here. Okay, that grabber isn't necessary right now. Oh, those armies. Oh, no, they're fine. Okay. That one took a lot of damage. That one did too. Just get that Meyer spawn real quick. It's a good thing we can just build more. Okay, let's just, uh... I mean, we have our particulate going there. I suppose we should just get rid of that ship spawner over here. Just get out of here. Yeah, be destroyed. the grabber is getting some whatever. What is happening here? Jeez. It should be enough. Should be in close enough range. Let's get the wolf out here so they can they can protect the armies. I honestly don't care about that. 
as much as it is there. Slowly get rid of that stunner. Move two more Omnis into view. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Nicely done. Well done. Really show that hammer who's boss. And that's fine. We can rebuild them. into range. Get that stunner out of here. Or firepower. Uh, you split. They're not doing too well. I suppose we can sneak in this. <laughs> it's more like not gonna work, but well, maybe. Where's the Mydrox gonna be here? Over here. Alright, nice. We will actually get that. And we laid this now. Hoping to. The hammer might go down. Oh. Yeah, the hammer's definitely going down here. The side vessel is just gonna ram into us, apparently. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, one for one trade, I suppose. This means you don't get ships. Oh, come on now. Let's, let's not get too frisky with that. Trying to get the engines. I just managed to kill that one. Well, I'll rally really point to that. Get rid of this Meyer spawner. Should have done that from the get go, but. Ships for you. Ah, uh, but you didn't expect two to be at the same place. <laughs> okay, yeah, I really can't chain commands with more than two ships. Two or more ships selected, okay. That's, well, I guess I just have to live with that, huh? Let's get rid of this mired land so we can actually use it to our advantage. Like, why can I do of Omnis, but not with... Not with fleets. So odd. Yeah, whatever. The Omnis should be fine. Yep. Self-sufficient. Oh, uh, actually, no, it's not, because it's gonna get... It's not going to get that 
Uh, I thought it would have been immersions, but no. I did not get immersionized? Uh, sure. <laughs> Send you there. Get this gravel, get some new snow. I'll move some space space particles in the way apparently. Let's help you out with that. Clear out your path a little. Still alive. Or at least was so was alive for so long. Okay, let's get three more omnis up there. So really don't want to see any more of that nonsense. Rally point is accurate, okay. Let's get all this neutral particles out of the way. And you're out of energy now. Just help you out a little bit with that micro tank. I'll move into the last emitter. Oh god. No. Anyway. Not both of our leaves. We can build two more though. But they took out our lead, man. Huh? Command ships leave. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna have to try and connect this in some fashion. Alright, that should be it. Amazing work, crew. We managed to fight off the doppels in the system and recover the tech. Has there been any additional signs of the origin world? The tech and no isotopic signatures for several systems. Odd. Perhaps we were just very lucky. Or perhaps any signatures have been removed over time. In any case, our journey con continues. Nice. Okay. And that will be the end of this episode. I will be seeing you in the next episode. Have a wonderful day or night, wherever you are, and I'll be seeing you.